Is a math major hard? Is a math major right for you? I get asked these questions a lot, so I'm gonna do my best to answer the question, is a math major, now I'm talking about a pure mathematics major here, is a pure mathematics major hard? Is it a difficult choice for study at college or university? Now I have to preface, preface this with, you know, it depends, right? It depends on so many things, it depends on where you go to school, which classes you choose, who your instructors are, you know, what type of math major are you? Are you pure? Are you applied? Are you computational? Something, something else? You know, how good at math are you to begin with going into the major? Is math one of your strong suits? Are you more inclined to it? And just what type of personality you have? And you know, just, you know, it depends on a lot, right? So I can only give you my opinion. It depends. That being said, number one, to decide whether a math major is hard. Well, look at the content, okay? The main reason I think that people would say that a math major is a hard major to do is just the content itself. And it's really the fact that math is one of the most abstract subjects out there, especially when you start talking about pure mathematics. I mean, when you're talking about pure mathematics, you're basically making definitions or assumptions, and then you just draw conclusions from that. And that's I mean, that's one way to look at what math is. Obviously, there's a quantitative aspect to it, but in nuts and bolts, that's what you're doing. And that's much less concrete than nearly every other major out there, unless you're talking about straight up logic or maybe some philosophy, something along those lines. Math is very abstract, and that makes the content quite hard. So it's not necessarily that the classes are hard, the tests might be easy. In fact, in my experience, professors have actually made it, you know, fairly manageable to pass their tests. They're usually very clear with their expectations. You know, they would provide you know, study guides or at least a list of topics that you should know. Like, you know, you know, know how to prove these 10 things and be prepared with all these definitions and so on and so forth. Obviously, again, it depends on the instructor, but just because the content was hard did not necessarily mean that it was hard to pass the class which again, it all depends, but in my experience, I, I thought there were classes that I did very well in that I did not necessarily know the material the best or understand the material, but I knew the professor and I was you know, a decent enough student to, you know, take their study guide and study the study guide and memorize what I had to and I could get through it, even though it was very abstract and challenging material. Number two, a reason why the math major can be hard is it's a very independent thing. So I've said before that math is sort of a solo sport. And if you're someone who thrives on groups or lots of social interaction and discussions and writing papers and discussing your ideas, that's not really what you're doing with math. You are essentially sitting down with the material, probably by yourself. I mean, it's very good if you can have a group and and talk with other people, but at the end of the day, it's kind of up to you in a way. And I've, I've recommended going out and getting study groups and working with people who are better than better at you, better than you at math in this channel. But, you know, can you learn the material by yourself? Those people aren't always going to be around and you need to be able to support yourself at least somewhat. So it's a much more independent type of major than some other majors out there. So that's one reason it could be difficult. Third thing here that I think was maybe making a math major actually easier than, than some other majors. The fact that there are no labs or like projects or presentations or, or things like this or group work, like, Every single one of the classes I took, you know, for the most part, there, there was no technology requirements uh, or I didn't have to go to a special building or anything like that. It was just a classroom. It's just a lecture hall. My homework were just problem sets, maybe out of the textbook or maybe just that the, home, the, the professor gave us at the time. But all you really had to do, you know, was show up to the class, 
take good notes, study, do the homework, and, and pass the tests. Whereas some other majors that I would think is maybe harder because of this reason, you know, you have to go to special facilities. I know my girlfriend would always have to go off campus to this special location to go to her classes where they had, you know, special equipment that they didn't have like in normal classrooms and had to meet with with other people and do group work and coordinate <clears throat> and all of these other things, you know, with with technology and you know, you name it. That it wasn't something I had to deal with just because, you know, well, it's just math, you know, you just, you know, you go do the problem, you learn the material and you're done. So that might be a way that it's almost easier than some other majors, or I think why some majors might be harder than a math major. Number four, that I think something is, is not something that I think very many people talk about. And it's that the math major almost has less work than other majors. At least this is in my experience. When I look at a major like engineering, I had engineering friends and it just seems like they were always, always busy. You know, there were lots of projects and group work and the sort of things I was saying you have to go to certain places to, to use the labs and, and lots and lots of problems. Seems like they had to take every class under the sun between physics and biology and all the sciences and the engineering and the math. And I was just like, man, it seems like a lot of work. <laughs> Whereas I was a math major you know, I take, you know, two or three math classes a semester. And, you know, you probably had a homework assignment each week from each class, but the homework assignments weren't especially long. They were abstract and sometimes they were challenging, but sometimes a homework assignment was as few as three or four questions, you know, which doesn't sound like a lot, but sometimes it can be. But just the sheer amount of work I felt like I had to do as a math major was much less than than my interpretation of other majors. It, it seemed like, you know, uh, as long as you knew the material, as long as you could digest the lecture, it's pretty much what you had to do. And it's good and it's bad. It's good if you can understand it. If you can't understand it, it's obviously bad. But if you know what you're doing, there's not a whole lot of work, which, which is interesting in a way. Uh, now, of course, if you're doing things like actuarial science, which is something that I double majored in, the material was hard and there was a lot of work. So I use that example just to really differentiate the fact that my actuarial science degree, as I was double majoring, I thought was much harder than my pure mathematics degree. Just not because of the concepts being harder, there was just more content and there was more work and there was more group work and projects and much longer homework sets and some technology and just all of those factors, not, not just mentioning that actual science has its own exam process, I'm not getting into that in this video, but I definitely think, at least for me, the actuarial science degree was much harder than the math degree. And so, uh, in my in conclusion, in my, in my opinion here is that the math major is hard. It's definitely a challenge, but I don't think it's one of the hardest majors out there. Of course, it all depends. And this is just from my experience. As far as the content, I think it is one of the harder majors in terms of content, just in terms of the abstractness. But as a whole, from start to finish, getting to the graduation stage, I do not believe it is one of the hardest majors you could pick. Maybe top 10, maybe top 15. But certainly, I think if you want to pick the hardest major, I don't know, maybe you could look elsewhere. But maybe this is good news. If you want to be a math major, then I think you should go for it. If you have the reasons, I've made videos as to reasons why you should be a math major. And so I don't want you to think, oh, math major is hard. I can't do it because that's just just not always the case. So those are just my thoughts today. Really appreciate you watching the whole video to the very end, and I'll see you in the next video.